station is Cobbett Square. Aces? Yeah, have my ace. All right. Uh, what about fives? Twenty fives? Go fish! No! Slipping out without saying goodbye. All right then. Goodbye, everyone. See you all later. All right, cheeky. Finish your coursework. Dotted every I, crossed every T. You can check if you want. Liar. Calm down, Sarge. Can I go out, Mum? Of course, Puddin. Say hello to Vivek for me. Would it kill you to spend some time with your family for once? I know. I'm sorry. How about I make dinner tomorrow night? That would be lovely, dear. I'll get the pizzas out of the freezer now then, shall I? What you see in my sister, I don't know, Ash. I guess I'm just stuck with her at this point. Off you go then. Text me when you're on your way home, love. Five pounds I could hit that car over there with a rock or something. Go on then. Nah, what if the alarm goes off? Too scared. No, I just don't want to upset the neighbour. Hey Donna. Hey, you got here quick. Not working at the Godfather tonight? Nah, Dad's had to close down for a few days. Right in the deep fat fryer again. You've spiked the batter, haven't you? <laughs> Nothing that exciting. Just a dodgy batch of scampi. Gave some people a runny bottom. Well, there goes that Michelin star. Never a dull moment in the Chowdhury household. Are you both finished? Did you see that guy just then? 
The one with the pretty lady. I did. I've been watching him from my window for a few nights now. Bit creepy. You okay? I keep seeing him bringing home different girls. Boys too. Sounds like a player. That's not the weird part. He brings them home, but I've not seen one of them leave. What are you saying? Well, I've had my suspicions for a while, but I'm now pretty convinced. I think he's building a guerrilla army. That's dumb. It's probably just a weird sex thing. Weird sex thing, I imagine. Oh yeah, I hadn't considered that. Probably a sex thing, yeah. We should play knock down ginger on him. Let's see if he's on Tinder. No way. We've got to be all forensic and stuff. Covert surveillance, like your sister. I don't think Emma would know the meaning of covert. Getting bored. Wanna do some gas? Oh, sweet. I'm up for that. Okay, Becky. What would you rather do? Be put in prison for 10 years, but when you come out, you get 20 million pounds, tax free. Or get the 20 mil up front, but you die when you're 35. What are you on about? Come on, which one would you take? I wouldn't take either. They both sound shit. No, you have to. Probably take the 20 million up front, rip it up on a yacht. But you die when you're 35. Yeah, I know. Like a really horrible, slow death. Okay, fine. I'll go to prison then. But it's solitary confinement for the entire time. That's okay. And you don't have a bed to sleep on. Just a stone floor with loads of spiders about. You're just adding stuff to make it work. Check it out. Freaky dude's back and he's all alone. Not this again. 
I wonder where he's going. We should follow him. No way! I don't want to be turned into a human kebab. He is pretty fit. Always thinking about boys. Of course. Let's follow him. I want his number. When he makes high concept art out of your body parts, don't say I didn't warn you. Look lively, Codfather. The catch of the day is getting away. You know, he's probably meeting with his superiors in the guerrilla army. I thought you'd abandon that theory. Yeah, I'm coming round to it again. Poor fella, he's probably just run out of condoms. Sounds about right. Could have saved himself a walk. You can get condoms in the loo at the ploughman's arms. I wonder if the entire gorilla army's made up of hotties. I can't deny, he's one handsome man. Almost as pretty as you, hun. Ah, oh, make a boy blush. This says echoes of those other conspiracy theories. Uh, wake up, sheeple. There are crazy things going on in this city. All those three months when he went full flat earther. On that occasion, I was just a victim of fake news. Never been to this part of town before. Me neither. Handsome guy's heading for that old building. Guerrilla army's still not off the table. Building looks big enough to be a fortress. Places are fallen down. Maybe he's setting up a rave. Okay, but what about all those people he's been disappearing? They're probably all inside having fun. Anyone up for a bit of breaking and entering? I'm game. You two are mental. What are you going to do? Just walk through the front door. I think there's another way in. over there. Crap! It's locked. Well, that's, uh, that's that then. One of those top floor windows are open. I'm sure we can get up there somehow. Imagine the likes. Oh, I can't shoot it from here. Let me find the right position.
Take it! This is mental! <laughs> Run, you fellas! Wait! You guys! hell have you done? What do you mean? He was going to attack Donna. Now you've gone and done it. A little appreciation here. I just saved your life. Dude, bollock naked. He's not dead, is he? He's got superpowers. He probably can't be killed. We got a call for an ambulance. Whoa, hang on there. Let's not make any rash decisions. I'm not getting in trouble for this. This was your dumb idea. Donna, what if your sister finds out about this? Oh, I don't know. I can't think straight. We need to move him. Let's get him inside, out of sight. <sighs> that should hold him for now. Thank God he's still breathing. Okay, so let's call an ambulance. We can call anonymously, they'll just show up. We don't have to be here. Hang on. We've left our fingerprints all over the place. And your sister's a copper? Well, we're screwed. We can't let him go. For the time being, he has to stay here. Emma? Where the hell are you? Tell me this instant! Just hanging out at Viv's. Sorry, lost track of time. Well, I'm at Vivex right now and you're nowhere to be seen. Oh, cool. We can walk back together then. Uh, that'll be nice. Uh, won't be a minute. Donna. Donna, don't you dare hang up on me. Well? Emma is looking for us. Your sister? She's outside Vivek's place right now. Emma's at the Codfather. You need to fix this, Donna. She can't come here. We'll go to prison. Oh, shit. Don't worry, Becky. I'll deal with this. Shh! Why are you shing us, Viv? I was trying to get you to stop saying our names. What's wrong? He's awake. <laughs>